today for uh, just one of our uh, charity episodes. We're raising money for the bottomless toy chest and uh, I was able to convince Nina to come out and run some lines. We're on uh, kind of our phase two setup. We do have two trot lines out in the water. One of them goes across the river. One of them goes up and down and then we got five limb lines and as uh, you should have just saw we threw out the jug, the get her done jug and Nina did say it when she threw it. Get her done. All right, guys, we're gonna check a few limb lines and a trot line, and hopefully we got some. Wish us some luck. It is about May. Temperature is pretty decent. The water's still cold, but it's warming up. It's beautiful out, though. It is a beautiful afternoon, guys. If you're just joining us, we do limb lines, trot lines, and jug lines. We got a little uh, event going on. All the rules were talked about in previous episodes. Got a little hang up. Oh, there's a fish. <laughs> there's a fish. Is there a fish? Yeah. Or was it a stick? No, it's a fish. He's little. And uh, I talked to Nina. She's trying to have a fish fry. She'd prefer uh, a flathead. Let's see what we got. Oh my God, how long is this line? I got it all the way to the bottom. That's probably why I wasn't moving. Oh, it's a little blue. Uh, Might be a channel. Yeah. Oh, he's better than I thought he was. Decent blue. Not 10, but that's $5 for our... That's a decent security. fish right there. There we go. So we'll, we'll keep him in there for a bit. See if we catch a better one. Oh, my God. This one I put out yesterday, so it's not situated right. The water was up, now it's going back down. It's got 12 hooks on it. Our other trot line has 12 hooks on it. 12? We only got 30 total. The rules. And we have five limb lines and a jug, so that's 30. Well, we've got a lot of vibration on this line right off the bat. Yeah, it's going to be tight. Be careful. And uh, I'll say another foot or two. This. Uh, this line will be good, but we'll see what happens. I got six kind of on this side, and then you go across the middle, which is where all the current is. And uh, six on that side. Goldfish is still alive. Yeah, it's always just a wonderful when you see your bait on there. At least it's still alive. I mean, you're fishing tomorrow, too. Some, somewhat spread out. This is actually the first run on this trial line. Empty hook. An empty hook. That's good. Again, guys, the trial line. It's fighting me. You got something? Yep. Oh, look at the swirl. All right. Look right there. It's hard to tell it out in the water like this. That's another blue, I think. About yeah, the same size. Blue. About the same size. I'll take a blue any day of the week. Yeah, we got the net. We lost one, a couple. And I'm, and I'm actually doing the experiment. I have circle hooks and regular J hooks. And that one, I think that one is also a circle hook. Get him in there, Nate. He just shot me straight in the face. I can't see. <laughs> da, da, da. All right, oh. guys. That's, that's another uh, under 10 pound fish. $5, as you know. Over 10, we get $50. Yeah, the water temperature should be rising in the next week, guys. And the water water level is actually better than it was last year or the year before. So, and we got pretty decent bait. So, no excuses. I know you guys are way ahead on the uh, little charity thing. You know, obviously we're all working together. We've already met our minimal goal. Now I'm just gonna go for double that. 
and uh, but, but we're hoping to catch up in uh, the month of May. Early. Live bait. Yeah, there's a little bit of bait still on there. It's all live, so I'm thinking that one was caught on cut bait. And I think that's, that. that's it. That's it. That's it. All live bait still alive and on the hook. So. All right, guys, we're gonna we're gonna head up, check some more limb lines in the final trot line. But first, roll call. Roll call. Where's it gonna be, Nina? What is a state that you would like to call out? Viewers uh, watching from this state. I have to go for Michigan because it's two states in one. Michigan. And you can own your own island for less than a million dollars. That's right, and. That's Nina's from, from Michigan. All you guys watching from Michigan, okay, send us a, a picture, okay, a selfie. Uh, preferably with something in Michigan in the background, okay? We get a lot of pictures on other roll calls with license and stuff. I don't, we're not necessarily looking for that. We're looking for just, hey, this is us. We just took this for this video, and here is, what's a landmark in Michigan? Corn. Corn. I would believe that. <laughs> Be creative, be creative, guys. Okay, so corn and snow. That's right. All right, guys. Uh, H HLC prizes at gmail.com. Okay, send it, and uh, I'll let Nina pick the winner. Ooh. I wish I had my camera out. Make sure I'm in the frame. I know you are. Uh, ready? <laughs> <laughs> I like how you like lay yours so gently, like, here darling, here's the water. Yeah, I usually do. You can tell you have kids and I don't. No, I usually throw them right in. I just, I think that one was uh, the lazy one and you got the hardcore one. So he, <laughs> he was swimming before he hit the water. Man, is this going to be a year for maples or what? I know. It seemed like this happened a few years ago, but this is more maple seeds or whatever. Helicopters is what we Helicopters, call it. yeah. I was filming in my garden the other day, and a helicopter actually came down and drilled me right between the eyes, right in the middle of talking about potatoes. Yeah, guys, and if you didn't know, Nina has her own YouTube channel. A lot of you guys ask, where's Nina? Okay. Nina. In my defense, I have been working this entire time to get myself a boat and get it running, and as of last week, it's running. Yes, guys, and uh, I was very on Nina last year about making a channel because I don't know how much longer I can keep this up <laughs> and she's so popular that she started her own she has a lot of followers and if you're not following then you're you're behind we do so far a lot of gardening and a lot of cooking but up until we actually had success with our bow motor running in a bucket of water we didn't have a whole lot of hope to be a fishing channel and all that has changed yeah. so she does she does a variety of stuff and she makes potatoes entertaining all right, on to the next lines. anything more on the limb line so we got our last trot line up river here got 12 hooks on it mixture of uh, bluegill goldfish and uh, cut bait fresh skipjack watch out that crash it's gonna crash Jerking. You got a jerking. I got a jerking in the line. Jerking in the line. Just a little baby jerking. There's, now this one will fool you too, because at the end I got a different setup. It's swinging. Well, what's what's weird is that it feels like there's something on that side of the line. Yeah, yeah. So no, I, there it is. I've been jerking. There it is. I've, Look, I've been... right here. I'm right on top of it. Watch out. You never know there what it you're is. gonna get. 
There it is. I got a lot of it in here. Oh, 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 whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, hey. Oh, it's a oh, flat. Oh, it's a flat. That's a decent flat. Yeah, he's not bad. That's like a four hush puppy dinner. Yeah, don't let him come off. There's $15 for our charity and maybe uh, a few pieces of meat for Nina's, Beautiful. Absolutely Nina's beautiful. Freezer. Quite the specimen. Yeah. Look at him. He's perfect. Yeah. I mean, bigger is better, but this guy is perfect. Yeah, actually, not much bigger. They call them eaters. And the frog's starting. There's my baby. Yeah. I'll take him home, kill him in my backyard. You may or may not do a video on it, guys. It all depends. Can get the boat. I guess I probably need to ask old Nina a couple questions. Let's see. Oh Lord. Nina Wren. We've asked a lot of questions on the channel. We have. This Nina, if you're following, just following, and I know a lot of you are. Uh, surely you've seen some of the old videos, though. If you haven't, check them out. Uh, Nina's been around since the beginning. And uh, we've got a lot of fish, and we've had a lot of fun times. And uh... all right, Nina, what's your what, of your memory? Do you have a favorite fish that you've caught yeah. on this channel? I say. do. Um, the best fish I ever caught was the day I lost your camera. So it did pretty good. Still got to get the hook out of that guy. It's in there pretty solid. But uh, did get one. Seems to be around 30 pounds or so. Really proud, was really happy jumping up and down. And I lost the camera and the tripod. And I don't want to have to tell Michael. So, took the wind out of my sails a bit, but. Any consolation, I know exactly where it went in. Oh, yeah. The one and only time you actually <laughs> let me take the boat out by myself, <laughs> run the lines by myself. Yeah, that was a funny time. He calls me up later back at Uncle Jimmy's and he's just joking with me. I heard you lost the camera. I was like, who told you? <laughs> yeah, that's actually a, somewhat of an episode. I tried to piece it together. It wasn't good because I lost all the footage. I mean, it was... A, yeah, me and Nina come back out. It day, would have been great. Days later and we, uh, we drug for that. Uh, I was just wanting to get the tripod back. Big old grappling hook. Yeah, it did not work. I must that, have sat in that spot, Michael, in the river for 45 minutes just sitting there like... That was about, what was that, 28 pound blue cat? A 27, yeah. 27. And that still to this day is the biggest blue cat I've ever caught with you. Well, 32. in your boat. 30. Pretty did sure. I catch a 30? Remember the Halloween episode? Oh, yeah. Friday the 13th. Oh, I, man, I was, he was a beast. Yeah, that was right around the corner here. Actually, right there. But I, I still, my favorite fish would have to be the one that... Yeah, I, I'm i out rafting in West Virginia, and, you know, we're I'm hardcore about making sure we get our episodes in, and, and Nina's like, I'll, I'll see if I can get get one recorded, and uh, didn't go as planned. Hence, all, at one time we had foam, we had noodles tied to everything, and now my camera's strapped in. I guess one burning question everybody's going to have is, uh, you have a bruise on your thigh, <laughs> yeah, um, I was trying to climb over something at work. I had a, ooh, we are hung up. I had a paper towel roll and I was going to put it right behind my boss's ear and scare him and make him think I was right behind him. He turned around and I tried to like climb down real quick like I wasn't doing anything and I caught my butt right on this uh, like welded metal corner shelf that we have. Mmm, so you paid for your shenanigans. Yeah, just messing around at work, trying to be funny. It didn't work out at all. I think it came out. Or it looked it like did. It did. It popped right out. Let's see if there was a fish that caused it. There's, there's not many hooks past that. There might be one more hook. I'm not feeling any bumps. I believe that's it. Well, guys, now we still have the jug. That's it. I, I had to take one of them off to make it. Okay, I see it. Yeah. I need to space them out a little bit better. Well, guys, uh, we caught two good-sized blues and Nina's Decent flathead, not Salt our best. Salt and pepper flat. It's a dark flat, but we, of course we have the jug and we'll, we'll go check it out. Uh, it's perfect. That's right. Beach. 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 That's a pretty 
shallow water it just went over. Yeah, it is. That's the beach, actually. I was going to say, that's the beach, isn't it? We probably will never see the beach again. Right? That sucks, man. They fixed the... They raised the water level with Rochester. Last year, it never got... Well, I can see some ripples there. I don't know about the log or the ground. See the bottom, let me know. Oh, it'd be nice to see that jug just take off. Right. It is actually sitting in a decent spot for once. I just think it's hung. It is hung. Yeah, it looked like it was moving there for a second. Nothing. Nothing. Guys, we're gonna throw it 30 times no matter what. Oh, there's the bottom. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, guys. Well, we did okay today. Not great, but not bad. Nina blessed us with her presence. Three fish. She's going on a trip soon. Uh, so what are you doing? We've got a lot of saltwater fishing videos coming up, actually. We went ahead and booked eight nights on an island waterfront. We're just going to spend the entire time that they were, they were there beach fishing. Um, we wanted to get out on the water, but obviously, if anybody has ever been to Florida, they know that fishing charters are $800 for a half day, at best, especially if you want to go after something decent. So we're going to do a lot of surf fishing and hopefully some cast net throwing. Yeah, so guys, uh, check out Nina. She's got her own channel. If you're one of the ones that keep asking me where Nina is, uh, she'll come on every now and then, special episodes. and. Uh, I thought I'd catch her before a big trip, so thanks for watching guys and we'll see you next time.